Daisy King Skyline YouTube tutorial. Today we're going to be looking at installing Daisy Community Offline mode and letting the uh, Daisy client actually open it. So here we've got Arkansas's Daisy Community Offline mode. This is a GitHub. Uh, it does have all the controls and stuff here and instructions on how to install it. These were a bit confusing for me. <clears throat> um, yeah, I just really didn't get this. So, what you're going to want to do is you can download this zip archive here, or you can click code and download zip here. Now, I've already got this, so I'm not actually going to download this. And uh, we'll go and find mine, which is right here. So, this is what it looked like for you. So you're going to want to go to where your daisy is installed. For me, it's on my games drive, in games, Steam, Steam apps, common, daisy. Okay, so yours may look somewhat, a little bit look like this, uh, but we're missing, we're missing a missions folder. So if we come over to this zip, we can open the community offline mode master, drag this missions into this folder. So now we have a missions folder in our Daisy. You can open offline mode by going into the mission that you wish and click the Daisy community offline mode dot bat. Or if you wish to load mods, you can do it through Daisy's launcher. If you come over to your parameters, all parameters, down to mission, click on the dots, go to Daisy, missions, generous. We'll select that folder. Go to mods, let's chuck a mod on. Uh, let's go for one of my test mods. Oh, no, I actually don't have any. We'll just go for my actual mod. It's because I don't have my P drive extracted, people. And what we did there is we just clicked play. We didn't select a server, we just clicked play. Now, this should load Daisy Community Offline mode. Da, 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 da. May take a while for it to first initialize. And there we go. Offline mode. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please like, comment and subscribe. Thank you.